Family is in complete shock. They have no idea whatsoever. This was their brother by blood, um, but they weren't too close to him. Everybody had their own families, everybody had their own children, everybody had their own life. They weren't as close as they were when they were 15, 16 years of age. The family's in complete shock. They're very um, sad for all the victims. They're, they have two losses of their own as well. The motive is very unclear. It could be, it could be a disgruntled worker. Um, at, at this point, since the investigation is so ongoing, it could be a disgruntled employee. It could be information that's coming out about their connections to different types of groups. We're still waiting. And until we make a determination, until we finish up with FBI on Monday and Tuesday, that's when we're going to be able to really see what this is kind of painted as. There has been no evidence that they've found yet. This is his words in the LA Times as of 1 p.m. today that they are linked to a larger organized terrorist group or terrorist cell. All there is, and this is much the frustration, I think, of the FBI and, and everyone, because we all, want, we all want an answer. We all, we all are angry. We're all frustrated. We're all sad. Um, we want justice. Um, but unfortunately, things, some things in life aren't as clear cut as that. And all there is thus far is some nebulous thing that somebody looked at something on Facebook I mean, any one of us may have looked at something on Facebook. It doesn't mean we believe in it.